while there was still some snow, we made sure to take advantage of it. So we're gonna shoot some uh, pictures for DMG Apparel. Uh, now that there's still snow, because it's actually a one degrees or two degrees Celsius, so it's slowly, whatever it's called, melting away. That's the word. So we're gonna shoot some pictures right now. Um, what? Yeah, I, I told Hunter to stay, and now he's just staying like this. <laughs> I don't think he wants to lay down because it's like wet, and he doesn't like it when something's wet. So instead, he's just like half. <laughs> oh, buddy, you're so cute. You're such a good boy. That afternoon, my mom and I decided to explore the forest near our cabin with the dogs. Yesterday at the husky sledding destination farm, um, they had these kind of like ooh, do ya? <laughs> they had these leashes they could put around your middle, which is a lot more comfortable than this because this is really not comfortable when do is pulling this much. Um, and then the dog will do all of the work, perfect for like working dogs like huskies. So they gave me the address or like the web address of the company that I could buy them. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's like a good 20 centimeters of snow over here. <laughs> and she really likes the pool. Yeah, <laughs> as you can see. They scant. Go, they scant. <laughs> and this is not very ideal because she's literally ripping my middle part apart. as well. We literally haven't seen a single person on this walk yet. Good morning, assistant. Hello. Are you comfy, bud? Do you have to thirsty? Hi. There's still so much snow, even though it hasn't frozen during the night at all. Um, we are happy that there's still some snow and so are the dogs. like that with the way his breath smells. For one night, I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey. So today we're doing something very exciting too. Um, we're going into, I think it's an hour drive towards more like the ski area. So hopefully there'll be more snow and cold than that there is over here at the moment. Um, so we can actually do this activity. Yeah, I think Dunya's gonna stay, stay inside. I don't know where she went. Oh, <laughs> I can't see her on the camera. Oh, over there. You little, oh, you're so cute. It was time to start our journey to Bukharnen. With the dogs cuddled up in the back, we drove through the snowy landscape and on the slippery roads. Not that easy, to be honest. We made a short stop for a stretching break and a quick video shoot for DMG Apparel. I 
arrived, we let the dogs out and truly enjoyed the winter paradise. Hunty! <laughs> this is uh, Hunter's pulling power. <laughs> oh. Oh, here he comes again. <laughs> no, I think it is. We're in Snowy Town right now. <laughs> what you do? Oh, it looks like snow scooters are coming our way. Excitement! Also, I'm not wearing any gloves and it's starting to get a little cold right now. I'm trying to film at the same time, which is not always the best combination. But, um, gosh, it's so gorgeous here. Yeah. Are you ready? Are you ready? Well, do you have your driving license with you? Right. <laughs> Our dogs have become a tourist attraction. Tourist. Yeah, tourist attraction. They're famous. <laughs> Bitches. Everyone wants a picture with Hunter. Are the traveling doggo? <laughs> <laughs> Bye. I was more than ready to conquer some snow and make everlasting memories. And apparently so was my dad. So amazed by the landscape around him, he crashed his snowmobile into a tree. continued into the dark hours. So we just had our snowmobile tour, snow scooter tour, uh, which was supposed to last two hours, but it lasted well over two and a half hours. Uh, people kept being stuck um, and just, it was an interesting ride. Um, and Megan and I actually, we didn't cause any like delays whatsoever. So I think we did a really good job. Uh, now we got the doggies out of the car again. Uh, they were just sleeping the entire time. Uh, and now they just want to like rouse around for a little bit. The last day was spent hanging around, enjoying the snow and sneaking in some time to capture my adorable huskies. Dunya, you look beautiful. What's that dress you're wearing? Hello. I touched the door. Oh, you're such a cutie. You're such a cutie. So it's our last uh, few hours here. Uh, we're leaving to Homstad uh, around 10.30 um, to celebrate New Year's Eve. And then we're leaving back to the Netherlands on the 2nd of January. So right now, we're just enjoying the last bits of this amazing scenery like it looks absolutely stunning when there's still snow on all of the trees and it snowed quite a bit still yesterday um, so Dunya is still taking her time to explore somewhere over there and I'm taking Hunty out I'm just gonna play in the snow for in the snow geez can I still talk I'm just gonna play in the snow for a little bit um, I'll take a couple more shots just enjoy the last bits, last bits of snow that we're gonna probably get, considering the Netherlands barely gets any snow anymore. Then we were off to Halmstad, where we spent New Year's. We started the new year with a refreshing beach walk and the most corona-proof dinner we could have ever had. Yeah, they were only supposed to be open for takeaway that evening, but very thoughtfully made an exception for us after I made a reservation online when I shouldn't have been able to. 
Overall, this trip was incredible. We got the chance to do some amazing things and spend time in a gorgeous place. Peace out, Sweden.